changed to Yakub because it means Jane and Israel because the name of the father, you know, our name. Um, I'm from originally from New York. My parents from the Caribbean. I noticed we have a lot of Caribbean-based people in here, but we know we all one tribe people. Um, I, uh, my background is computer, you know, computer engineering, and I also do, you know, fitness things. And uh, I've been to Florida for about ten years now, and you know, this is the walk of the Most High that brings all together. You know, coming from New York, I mean, you know, a lot of people we've seen before, so I just, you know. Welcome everybody and um, you know, y'all bless. Hallelujah. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, 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 I mean, good luck. I'm Brother Orlando. Y'all are good, man. We're on the most side, that's all. Oh, okay, all right. Well, to Boris, to everybody. I mean, most see no cheap. I don't know. But I'm going to come around. I haven't seen you before. What's your name, Brother? Yes, Brother Bishop. For Kusum. Mm -hmm. all right? I admit you. Are you? What's up? All right, cool. Your name? Sanobia. Sanobia. All right. What's your name again, Brother? All right. But yeah, man, I just came in here. My walk started about 14, 15 years ago in this. And um, when the most I found me, I was in the deepest, darkest hole of life. You know, uh, I was 11 years old, and I, the Jehovah Witness came to our house, and they had this Watchtower magazine, and they had this symbol on it. I was 11. And I saw that symbol, and it was beautiful to me. And I kept it all those years. When I turned 18, I got this tatted on me. And I was running in life, doing bad things, you know, where I was going. And I ran across a white Jew. And he said, you know what you have on your arm? And I was like, oh, well, this symbol looks good to me, you know? <laughs> 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 right, so that's how we, we come in the thing. I mean, y'all who will bring us all from places? you got to come from somewhere to go somewhere. And all of us, and we were speaking the other day, everybody has a talent to reach someone. I mean, uh... With me being scarred up, coming from the streets from where I came from, I can go out there to a guy that just came out of prison and bring him closer to the Most High. Where a guy who who never been in that realm or in that state, he can't go to that guy. That guy will shed it now. Like, Man, I only been in about this. So everybody in here is built for a reason. And if you're here, Yahuwah has a purpose for you. Shalom. Shalom. How you came in? <laughs> How you came in? <laughs> I've been doing this walk for probably about two years now, and I got introduced to the name through Fisk God, right? Yeah, right. <laughs> I've been just kind of doing my studies since, and I, you know, I came out of Christianity, and I really, he taught me the name, and I went and do, did all the research on Christianity. I said, let me start looking at what I actually think I believed in, and really found out that it was all pagan. They admit it in their own history books. You, you really to do the research, you can find it all there, and... You know, most of us really were just searching for something and wanted something to believe in, and it was there, and we never did the research, so that's where I came from. Yeah. Um, I am Susan Levy, that's what I'm called. Um, my walk before this, I, you know, I've been a Rastafarian for like most of my life, in some 30-something years, and um, really been into Torah as it is for the past, um, within the past year, less than a year actually, and what I've learned is that um, um, for my, my lifestyle, basically my liberty was pretty much the same. What I have acquired here now is, um, you know, that it's the most high and we do not have a deity, you know, as we have looked yeah. at this in my other lifestyle. And so much now, you know, so it's really back to our base and, and the most high and, you know, so it, it was like, it's still unfolding because to roll back 30 something years, like a baby. <laughs> <laughs> it's still unfolding, you know, so pretty much, you know, I, I'm really happy to see this today. Yeah. 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 That's what the most I does to you. When you come from somewhere, yeah. you think you know so much, and we bring you from somewhere, and you see something. I, mean, I know what I tell people. When I first read the Torah, I did it with some me. It, it showed me how far I was deep in the hole, how far I was really in the hole in life. You learn the most high will and stuff, and not the world will. Shalom, shalom. Okay, we we gonna we gonna mix we gonna mix seats. You know, one right here.
I'll tell you what, I'm going to do this. Let me cut this.